Honourable Members, and I call the member for Bendigo and welcome her back. Thank you, Deputy Speaker. Well, it has been a challenging time, particularly for workers and businesses. And since the government's rollout of the JobKeeper program and other measures, uh, I have decided and started a survey of just how the government support is actually helping businesses. And what we found, Deputy Speaker, is that 67 per cent, only 67 per cent of the businesses that we survey had accessed any government support, mostly JobKeeper and the cash flow boost. When it came to JobKeeper, these were some of their comments. Poorly communicated, poorly rolled out. Given the short time frame, there was always likely to be problems. However, the government has moved quickly from the position of we're all in this together to making businesses bear the brunt of the work and the costs. Confirmation. Paying wages in advance is a challenge. It's really scary if we make a mistake or the payment doesn't come through. So many workers eligible for JobKeeper um, but I don't have the cash flow to pay them in advance. I haven't participated because of this fact. Deputy Speaker, the government needs to do more to help our businesses, particularly our small businesses. If you want to snap back, you need to ensure that more have access to JobKeeper and more have the ability to access loans to help those in need.